How we doing today, YouTube? Deesky from Deesky Grills back with another cooking video. And today will be our first cook using Piedmontese beef. Folks, I'm very excited about this cook. We're gonna fire up that Sunterra San Maria style grill and do some San Maria style cooking with this Piedmontese beef. Now, let me show you the stars of the show. We have two eight ounce beef inside skirt steaks that are certified Piedmontese. So if you saw my previous video, I explained that this makes up only 1% of all the cattle in the world. So it's a rare beef that is heavy on protein and really lean on fat. Now it was even said that some of these different cuts are even more healthy than roasted chicken. So what I'm going to do is put this to the test, folks. Let you guys see when we cook this thing Santa Maria style, we're going to come to the cutting board, get this baby cut up, sliced, do a true taste test, and let you know if I think Piedmontese is the way to go. I want to thank you as always for joining me. Let's get cooking. Okay, folks, we are back. So let's check out the grill setup. So here's what we got going on. We have a little bit of lump charcoal dead in the middle. We have four nice logs of pear wood. So my local wood man got pear in and I was really excited about it and seeing how pear infuses flavor into your meat. So we're gonna be cooking with pear wood today. I'm gonna use a grill gun to get this baby fired up. So all we're gonna do, this takes about 40, 45 minutes minimal for everything to ash over and be ready to start cooking on those embers. So I wanted to go ahead and get this started. Then we go back to the cutting board and season up that awesome Piedmontese beef. So let's get this fired up. Okay, so we are lit. So folks, this will take at least two or three minutes, and from there we can head on inside and go ahead and season up that awesome Piedmontese skirt steak and look up close and see what this beef is all about. I'll meet you guys inside. Okay, folks we are back and I am so excited as always to bring new things to this channel so let's check out the Piedmontese certified beef now this is beef skirt steak as you can see um, I misspoke at the very beginning these are one pound packs of beef inside skirt steak so let's get them opened up first off I want you guys to notice the rich red color that they have so let's get them cut open look a little bit closer and see how they look up close This is gonna be phenomenal. You're talking about skirt steak on the Santa Maria style grill. We know this grill imparts nothing but awesome wood flavor into your meats. This is our first time trying out the Piedmontese beef. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be great. It's going to be great. Okay, so here we are. Look at this, folks. It's just beautiful, beautiful. Nice and red in color. One pound skirt steak. Okay, so this is what we have. Now we're gonna go simple on our seasonings, but you can see the bold richness. Now again, heavy in protein, lean in fat. That's what you get from the Piedmontese beef. What I'm looking forward to seeing is just how tender it is uh, when we slice into it because it's said to be just as tender as prime beef. So this is gonna be something we put to the test in today's cook. Let's get this one opened up. Now we're gonna go simple with our seasonings today. We're gonna to go with the heaven made products, fabulous fajita. And that's all we're gonna put on this beef. Now with using that grill gun, we cut the time in half before it is time to get started cooking uh, because that torch really, really got the grill started up. Look at this beautiful, rich red color. Gracious alive. This looks really good, folks, really good. Okay, so we have these things laid out, all right? Now, again, we will be using the fabulous fajita. So let's get it seasoned up on both sides. Okay, so this is what we got, pat it in. We'll let this rest on the cutting board while the grill continues to get ready. And I'll meet you guys outside for the most important part of this video. And you know what that is. Let's get cooking. See you in a bit. Okay, folks, we are back. We have the Santa Maria roaring. We have awesome Piedmontese beef skirt steak ready to hit this grill. So you know what part of the video this is. Let's get cooking. 
it's time to get these beautiful skirt steaks added. Let's go with that now. Nothing like that beautiful sizzle. Okay, folks, so we got it going. Now, I'm gonna bring veggies out a little bit later, but let's just concentrate now on these beautiful slices of beef skirt steak. Now, remember with the Santa Maria style grill, you have the opportunity to lower or raise your grill grate, depending on the temperature you're trying to achieve. So what I wanna do first is go ahead and take it off the flame. I don't want it on there uh, too close because this is gonna cook fast, right? So let's come up a little bit and just show you the functionality of this grill. So we're coming on up. And we'll cook about at that level there. We have infusion happening of this awesome pear wood. So folks, I'll tell you the flavor we get from this pear wood too. First time using that. But right now it just smells amazing. There's nothing like wood fire cooking. So I'll let that go for a little bit. Come back with you guys in a bit when it's time to do the first flip. I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay folks, we are back and it is time for our first flip. Let's get this beautiful beef turned over. Look at this folks. You have these wonderful sear marks that the V-Channel Grill Grapes put on your meat. Absolutely amazing, absolutely amazing. Now again, this thin skirt steak won't take long, so I'm gonna go ahead now and bring our veggies out and get those put around the grill. I'll see you guys in a second. We're gonna roll the film for a little bit. I mean, Santa Maria style cooking is so exciting. You see the flame roaring, you see the smoke infusing your meats. I mean, this is absolutely amazing. Here's our veggies. So all I wanna do is get those babies added, okay? And we'll just kind of spread those across on both sides. We're gonna grill us up some peppers and onions today. All right, so easy enough. Lay these babies on. This might be the making of a thumbnail, what do you think? Let's get that laid in there. Okay, folks, so this is what we got going on. We'll let it roll for a minute so you can hear that flame kissing the meat. At the end of the day, this is what it's all about. We're gonna infuse some good beef skirt steak. First time using Piedmontese beef. I'm gonna give you my final thoughts on it at the cutting board when we slice into this awesome beef. And all we're doing here is just grilling up some good peppers and onions. So this is what's going on today on d -Ski Grills, using the Sunterra 48 inch Santa Maria style grill. Everything is awesome, folks. I'll catch you guys at the cutting board a little bit later. Okay, folks, we are back checking out the final product of our Piedmontese beef skirt steak made on the Sunterra 48 inch Santa Maria style grill. I'm gonna move this to the side. I just thought it'd be a good little thumbnail for us. Move this to the side and let's check out the star of the show. Folks, we have awesome Piedmontese beef skirt steak here, grilled to perfection. We also grilled up our veggies, right? So we did onions, red and green bell pepper. All it's time to do now is cut into this baby and see what it's all about. So here we go. We'll move this one to the side. And real quick, now you always wanna cut against the grain, so let's not forget that. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this right in the middle to make it easy, all right? And we'll move this to the side. And then we're coming this way, folks. We're going against the grain, and let's get us some slices and see what this beef is all about, right? So lean, full of protein, and supposedly so much better for you than traditional beef that we eat all the time. Okay, so we got a few slices. Let's see how this stuff's looking. Beautiful, rich red color. Cooked through and through, pull apart good. I'm gonna give it a taste and we're gonna close this video out. Mmm. Mmm. Delicious. So flavor profile, it tastes just like regular beef, just more lean, right? So you can see there's juice. We have juices flowing. Mmm. It has a really, really good rich taste. If I would have done anything uh, differently, I would have added more of the Santa Maria style flavor to give it a little more salt, but the flavor is absolutely on point. So let me get some of these veggies. We got our peppers and onions. Hmm. This is a one-two punch, folks. I'll make sure to leave a link to the description for Piedmontese beef. I definitely recommend you guys giving it a shot. It'll definitely make our loved ones more happy too, knowing that we're trying leaner, more better for you beef, right? If you like what we're doing, please subscribe to my channel. Let others know what D-Ski Grills is up to. And as always, at D-Ski Grills, grilling is not a pastime. It's a passion. Sorry, I can't stop eating. 
I'll catch you guys on the next one.